Yeah, so I think one of the things that, that we've been probably proud as well is how reactive we've been to the, the changing situation. So mm -hmm. if you look at any plan or any uh, sort of strategy, it's how dynamic you can be when that needs to change. So when you look at the coming second half of the season, we expected that the B team would have the Glasgow Cup, where obviously the first team games against Patrick Thistle, Queen's Park and Clyde. That's probably not going to happen in the second half of the season. Um, the SPFL uh, Challenge Cup didn't happen either. So we've now got a situation where the probably B team football, there won't be as much of that. Mm -hmm. So what we've done is we've now got, I think, over 14 players out on loan, certainly mm -hmm. 10 across the top two divisions in Scotland. And again, hopefully that's a, a mark and the strides that we're making that we can get players in the top two divisions. So we want to make sure that our young players are in an environment where they're most likely to play football. So for the B team, there'll be much fewer B team games in the second half of the season and more loan football. The under-18s, on the other hand, they should hopefully have a lot of fixtures when football starts back to catch up to play a full league programme and qualify again, hopefully for the UEFA Youth League. So they should get lots of football. Hopefully, having missed so much football, they'll be weekend, midweek, weekend, midweek, mm -hmm. all the way through. So yeah, quite a different programme from we anticipated. And, and I must say, I think for the likes of Brian Gilman and Kevin Thompson, who were taking their first year with the B team, couldn't have been a more challenging year to start that programme. I feel really sorry for them that this is the first year doing it and actually the programme's quite different. But the way those guys have adjusted to now we're looking at individual player development rather than team development has been terrific as well. So yeah, quite a different plan, but hopefully reacting very positively and, and producing something that ranges that means that our young players are still continuing to develop in a really positive way.